After nearly a decade of training and after a decade of faithful ministry at so many levels in this church, after demonstrable, proven character and usefulness in ministry has been evident to all in this church, and after a year-long internship in a pastoral residency internship And after the opportunity that you have had over the course of the last year and specifically over the last four weeks to give input as a church into Omri's life and ministry, the elders are thrilled at this point to install Omri Miles as a pastor, elder, shepherd at Grace Bible Church alongside of us. So we would like Omri and Emily to come up. You can bring your quiver full. And I would like the elders who are in the room to come forward at this time. We're going to lay hands on Omri. We're going to charge Omri for pastoral ministry. And we're going to pray for him and for this church. Omri, I'm going to give you this charge that the Lord gives to pastors from 1 Peter 5. Omri, we charge you to shepherd the flock of God among you, exercising oversight, not under compulsion, but voluntarily, according to the will of God, and not for sordid gain, but with eagerness, nor yet as lording it over those allotted to your charge, but proving to be an example to the flock. And when the chief shepherd appears, you will receive the unfading crown of glory. Let's pray together. Heavenly Father, we thank you so much for raising up such a servant as Omri Miles. We thank you for Emily, his wife, and for his myriad children. Lord, we thank you for the ways you've gifted and equipped and trained Omri. And not only with the fullness of your word in diligent study, but through trials, through hardships, Uh, through the applying of biblical principle in counsel and in relationships, in preaching, and in continued diligent study. We pray that as he pursues you from the heart, you would always and ever be his first love, that his devotion to his family would flow out of that love, and his shepherding care for us as a church would flow out of his commitment unwaveringly to your glory. Lord Jesus, may he decrease and you increase. We pray that his invisible service would continue and would grow into much visible fruit in the lives of your people. For your glory and for the building up of your church, we pray it in Jesus' name.